All right, so I was filming uh, yesterday some uh, Loot Crate stuff, and um, then I got interrupted and had to put up the new TV, as well as uh, the one upstairs with the PS5. So this came in yesterday as well, um, but I didn't have time to do an unboxing for it. This is the Plastic Cell Donatello. Um, it came out, uh, well, I think I reserved it in June or July, and I finally got both of them in, gave one to my brother. This one's mine. This is, they only made 500 of these, so this is 131 out of 500. And then I have a couple of Raphael's and I'm waiting for Mikey, which should hit sometime this month. That's what they said on their Instagram. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try to get a couple of those as well. But um, <clears throat> here we go with the unboxing. Uh, one thing I will say about this compared to Leonardo, because Leonardo is trash. Not the, not the plastic cell skull. Actually looks great. I just don't like Leonardo as a character. Anyways, um, Donatello, movie Donatello is my favorite, uh, 90s movie Donatello is my favorite one from the 90s movie, hence I said 90s uh, Donatello. With the design that they did for, with this one, it's more of an animated pose that he's doing compared to Leonardo's, which I did a video um, a couple of months back uh, for it. So I'm hella excited for it. The box art as well is cool. They uh, stuck with the, um, with the cartoon cartoonish uh, theme of it um, and uh, I'll have some snapshots that I'll incorporate here uh, so that uh, so you're able to see it also by the way if you hadn't been checking out the Ninja Turtle comic books from IDW um, it's incredibly good I actually since the start of COVID once I got out of debt I went back and purchased all of the comics. Um, it's very hard to come by as far as first printings and uh, different variants uh, all the way to now. So sometime next week, um, this is Sunday, so sometime like Wednesday or Thursday, I should get the other, I think, 15 or 20 comic books uh, that I've been missing, so I'll be current and up to date. So. What IDW also did, which was cool, is that um, I, I'm assuming it's them because it's all ID comics that they do from Transformers to Ninja Turtles to Sonic the Hedgehog and everything else. Animated, well they didn't animate it, but they took pages out of the comic books and they go through each one uh, and they have voice actors that do all the different voices for each character. Uh, so if you don't have the comic book, you can at least see it through here. It's uh, Star Force. I'll, I'll try to remember to have something so you can see it on YouTube. Very, very cool. Um, that's how I started. I mean, I've always been an Ninja Turtle fan, but I wasn't paying any attention to the comic book line. And I know we're about to get to this, but I want to give them a shout out just because it is so good. Um, and uh, after the first three comics that I saw in here, I said, oh, I got to start collecting these. Uh, so that's why I started doing that. So I at least wanted to give them a shout out, let you guys know about it. If you didn't know, um, it is uh, it's very much worth it. If you don't want to buy the comics, you can just wait to do this. They just started back up doing other um, uh, the other comic books. Uh, there's about 112 out now. Uh, that doesn't include all like the mini series things like the Turtles in Time, the Universe, and all this other stuff. Uh, that they're gonna be doing when they do it, the Foot Clan, all that stuff. So they just started back up because COVID shut it down. Uh, but uh, anyways, let's get to the unboxing. Right? All right, here we go. I have been waiting for this Donatello for a minute. And um, I'm collecting all four. And I'm going to, I just got an autonomous desk to a standing desk. And so I'm gonna put the Donatello bust on it. And then, uh, along with all my uh, monitors and everything else, and I'll probably have the sculpts there as well, hopefully. Um, so, right off the bat, um, I'm loving this. I also love the fact that uh, on the bottom of this, and I'll have a screenshot of that uh, right here. Uh, 
I, like I was saying, I love that they uh, they improved this. On the Leonardo one, they just wrote whatever number for it. Or at least mine didn't have a card. On the two Donatellos that I that had received, um, it had this new like gold signature and everything else. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. And so, there we go. Oh, let me take this drink out the way. Sorry. And, um, go this way. And so there, there are magnets on this, so it closes it. Pretty cool. It's like the Leonardo one. And of course, they have the little, uh, little banner or, or whatever that comes with it. And probably the same thing that he said before as far as growing up with his brother. Yeah, with the Ninja Trolls. Very, very cool. So, here we go. Protective phone cover. Oh, man, this is awesome. Okay. Okay. So, this is him right here. Um, obviously, it's at a distance. Um, it looks like he comes with his hand severed and they give you mounting putty. This is the mounting putty to apply a tiny amount, uh, which is a grain of rice, to the inside of Donatello's wrist to attach the hands and, re and uh, removable and reusable non-toxic. I was saying that it's, it's removable and reusable. Okay, that is friggin' dope. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and have some screenshots here. I won't put the putty on him, but I'll at least do the screenshot so you can see it. I'll take him out of the box as well. Um, and uh, do a 360 uh, so you can get a better idea of what he looks like, how he looks. This looks pretty freaking awesome uh, from what I'm seeing right now. Uh, I'm very, very excited about this design uh, and look at the guy. All right, as you can see. That's the putty. And then that's the bow staff with the hands. Once again, this is Courtney, and thank you for watching the video. Please like, subscribe, and share with others. Like I always say, have a better day, have a better month, have a greater year.